Four years have passed since the mortal races banded together and stood united against the might of the Burning Legion. Though Azeroth was saved, the tenuous pact between the Horde and the Alliance has all but evaporated. The drums of war thunder once again. Noble humans of Stormwind are a proud, tenacious race. Though the recent invasion of the demonic Burning Legion decimated their sister kingdom of Lordaeron, the defenders of Stormwind stand vigilant against any who would threaten the sanctity of their lands. Nestled in the foothills of Elwyn Forest, Stormwind City is one of the last bastions of human power in the world. Ruled by the Child King, Anduin Rin, the people of Stormwind remain steadfast in their commitment to the Grand Alliance. Backed by their stalwart allies, the armies of Stormwind have been called away to fight the savage horde on distant battlefields. With the armies gone, the defense of Stormwind now falls to its proud citizens. You must defend the kingdom against the foul mongrels that encroach upon it and hunt down the subversive traitors who seek to destroy it from within. Now is the time for heroes. Now humanity's greatest chapter can be told. Stoic dwarves of Ironforge spent countless generations mining treasures from deep within the earth. Hidden within their impregnable stronghold of Ironforge Mountain, they rarely ventured beyond the wintry peaks of Dunmora. Recently, however, the dwarves unearthed a series of ruins that held secrets to their ancient heritage. Driven to discover the truth about his people's fabled origins, the great king Magni Bronzebeard ordered that the dwarves shift their industry from mining to archaeology. As part of the Grand Alliance, the stalwart dwarven armies have been called away to battle the merciless horde in faraway lands. In these perilous times, 
the defense of the mountain kingdom falls to brave dwarves like you. The spirits of the ancient kings watch over you, and the very mountains are your strength. The future of your people is in your hands. For 10,000 years, the immortal night elves cultivated a druidic society within the shadowed recesses of Ashenvale Forest. Yet recently, the catastrophic invasion of the Burning Legion shattered the tranquility of their ancient civilization. Led by the arch druid Malfurion Stormrage and the priestess Tyranda Whisperwind, the mighty Night Elves rose to challenge the demonic onslaught. Though victorious, the Night Elves were forced to sacrifice their cherished immortality and watch their beloved forests burn. Seeking to regain their immortality, a number of wayward druids conspired to plant a special tree that would link their spirits to the eternal world. Despite Malfurion's warnings that nature would never bless such a selfish act, the druids planted the great tree Teldrassil off the stormy coasts of northern Kalimdor. Within the twilight boughs of the colossal tree, the wondrous city of Darnassus took root. However, the great tree was not consecrated with nature's blessing and soon fell prey to the corruption of the Burning Legion. Now the wildlife and even the limbs of the great tree itself are tainted by a growing darkness. As one of the few night elves still left in the world, it is your sworn duty to defend Darnassus and the wild children of nature against the Legion's encroaching corruption. The eccentric, often brilliant gnomes are held as one of the most peculiar races of the world. With their obsession for developing radical new technologies and constructing marvels of mind-bending engineering, it's a wonder that any gnomes have survived to proliferate. Over the years, the gnomes have contributed ingenious weapons to aid the Grand Alliance in its fierce battles against the Horde. Thriving within the wondrous techno-city of Gnomeregon, the gnomes shared the resources of the forested Dumora peaks with their dwarven cousins. Yet recently, a barbaric menace rose up from the bowels of the earth and invaded Gnomeregon. Aided by their dwarven allies, the gnomes fought a valiant battle to save their beloved city. Nevertheless, Gnomeregon was irrevocably lost. The surviving gnomes fled to the safety of the dwarven stronghold of Ironforge. There they remain, devising strategies to retake their city. As a gnome of proud standing, it falls to you to answer the challenge and lead your curious people to a brighter future. Long ago, the Orcish Horde was corrupted by the Burning Legion and lured to the world of Azeroth. For generations, the Orcs made war upon the human kingdoms of Stormwind and Lordaeron. Though the Horde was ultimately defeated, a visionary young warchief named Thrall rose to lead his people in their darkest hour. Under Thrall's rule, the orcs freed themselves from the chains of demonic corruption and embraced their shamanistic heritage. After years of wandering, the orcs founded their own kingdom in the harsh wastelands of Durotar. Based in the warrior city of Orgrimmar, they stand ready to destroy all who would challenge their supremacy. As a proud defender of Durotar, it is your duty to crush your enemies, both seen and unseen, for the nefarious agents of the Burning Legion still wander the land. Bound to the iron will of the tyrant Lich King, the vast undead armies of the Scourge seek to eradicate all life on Azeroth. Led by the Banshee Sylvanas Windrunner, a group of renegades broke away from the Scourge and freed themselves of the Lich King's domination. Known by some as the Forsaken, this group fights a constant battle, not only to retain its freedom from the Scourge, but also to slaughter those who would hunt them as monsters. 
With Sylvanas as their banshee queen, the Forsaken have built a dark stronghold beneath the ruins of Lordaeron's former capital city. This hidden undercity forms a sprawling labyrinth that stretches beneath the haunted woods of the Tirisfal Glades. Though the very land is cursed, the zealous humans of the Scarlet Crusade still cling to their scattered holdings, obsessed with eradicating the undead and retaking their homeland. Convinced that the primitive races of the Horde can help them achieve victory over their enemies, the Forsaken have entered an alliance of convenience. Harboring no true loyalty for their new allies, they will go to any lengths to ensure their dark plans come to fruition. As one of the Forsaken, you must massacre any who pose a threat to the new order, human, undead, or otherwise. Once a nomadic people, the Tauren roamed the endless plains of the Barrens, hunting the mighty Kodo. Scattered across the land, the wandering tribes were united only by their common hatred for their sworn enemy, the marauding centaur. Seeking aid against the centaur, the great chieftain Cairn Bloodhoof befriended the savage orcs who had recently journeyed to Kalimdor. With the orcs' help, Cairn and his tribe were able to drive back the centaur and claim the grasslands of Mulgore for their own. Upon the windswept mesa of Thunder Bluff, Cairn built a refuge for his people. Over time, the scattered tribes united under a single banner. Though the noble Tauren are peaceful in nature, the rites of the Great Hunt are venerated as the heart of their spiritual culture. As a tribesman of Mulgor, you must test your skills in the wild and prove yourself in the Great Hunt. The vicious trolls that populate the numerous jungle isles of the South Seas are renowned for their cruelty and dark mysticism. Barbarous and superstitious, they carry a seething hatred for all other races. Long since exiled from his ancestral homeland in Stranglethorn Vale, the Dark Spear tribe was nearly destroyed by rampaging murlocs. Rescued by the young war chief Thrall and his orcish warriors, the Dark Spear tribe swore allegiance to the Horde. Led by the cunning shadow hunter Vol'jin, the Dark Spears now make their home in Duratar, along with their orcish allies. As one of the only surviving Dark Spears, it falls to you to reclaim the glory of your tribe.